Russia and NATO are at loggerheads. In focus is a massive troop buildup at the Ukrainian border. Ukraine has accused Moscow of building up troops on its border. According to reports, Russia is moving tanks, armored personnel carriers and other equipment to regions that border Ukraine. Military buildup is also happening in Crimea, a region that Moscow annexed from Ukraine in 2014. United States has expressed its growing concerns over the security situation in eastern Ukraine. U.S. President Joe Biden has pledged unwavering support for Ukraine in the face of Russia's ongoing aggression, as he held his first talks with the Ukrainian leader Zelensky since coming to power. Ukrainian President Zelensky said that he had received assurances from U.S. President Biden in a phone call that Washington would not abandon Ukraine in the face of Russian aggression. Zelensky has hailed Kiev's partnership with Washington as crucial amid the escalating tensions with Russia. На цьому шляху ми маємо повну та незмінну підтримку всіх. Підтримку міжнародних партнерів України, зокрема Європи і Сполучених Штатів Америки. І одним із підтверджень цього є розмова, яку я провів сьогодні з президентом Сполучених Штатів Америки Джо Байденом. Ми детально обговорили ситуацію на Донбасі. Президент Байден запевнив мене, що Україна ніколи не залишиться на одинці проти агресії Росії. Washington has been Ukraine's one of the most powerful allies since Russia's annexation of Crimea in 2014. NATO has also voiced concern over this troop buildup. Russia, meanwhile, has hit back with a chilling warning. According to the Kremlin, any deployment of NATO troops to Ukraine would lead to further tensions. Russia has also warned that any attempt to start a new war in Donbas could destroy Ukraine. Moscow and Kiev have long accused each other of failing to implement a peace deal on Donbas. And the Russian activity poses an early challenge to Biden administration as well. In a public show of support for President Zelensky's government, Biden administration held phone calls with senior Ukrainian officials this week. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.